area of triangle in your earlier classes you have studied how to calculate the area of a triangle when its base and corresponding height that is altitude are given you have used the formula area of a triangle is equal to half into base into altitude in class 9th you have also studied heron's formula to find the area of a triangle now if the coordinates of the vertices of a triangle are given can you find its area well you could find the lengths of the three sides using the distance formula and then use heron's formula but this could be tedious particularly if the lengths of the sides are irrational numbers let us see if there is an easier way out let abc be any triangle whose vertices are a x1 y1 b x2 y2 and c x3 y3 draw ap bq and cr perpendiculars from a b and c respectively to the x axis clearly abqp aprc and bqrc are all trapezia now from figures it is clear that area of triangle abc is equal to area of trapezium abqp plus area of trapezium aprc minus area of trapezium bqrc you also know that the area of a trapezium is equal to half into sum of parallel sides into distance between them therefore area of triangle abc is equal to half into bq plus ap into qp plus half into ap plus cr into pr minus half into bq plus cr into qr that equals to half into y2 plus y1 into x1 minus x2 plus half into y1 plus y3 into x3 minus x1 minus half into y2 plus y3 into x3 minus x2 that equals to half into x1 into y2 minus y3 plus x2 into y3 minus y1 plus x3 into y1 minus y2 thus the area of triangle abc is the numerical value of the expression half into bracket x1 into y2 minus y3 plus x2 into y3 minus y1 plus x3 into y1 minus y2 bracket close